Now that we have nutrition out of the way, let's talk about cardio. Cardio has become very controversial in the industry because many coaches have overused it on their clients in order for them to lose weight, while others are completely opposed to it. Both extremes are incorrect. Cardio should be seen as two things, a tool to aid you in fat loss and to improve cardiovascular health. Being in the gym for two hours doing cardio because your body has hit a plateau is not healthy. You should never get your body to that point. When nutrition alone is no longer providing fat loss, then you can start manipulating your cardio. And what I mean by this is increasing frequency and duration of cardio, as well as changing up the type of cardio you do. There are two types of cardio, lift and hit. Lift is short for low intensity, steady state cardio. This type of cardio is done for a longer duration, let's say about 30 minutes, and your speed stays the same throughout the session, as well as your heart rate. It's fairly easy to do. You're able to watch your favorite show while doing this type of cardio. Very easy on the joints and great for endurance. Easy recovery too. An example would be 30 minutes on the Stairmaster. Hit is high intensity interval training. An example would be 20 seconds of sprints on a bike and 90 seconds off for five rounds. Now many people think that they're doing HIT, but they really aren't. You should be doing high intensity with every interval in order to properly perform and get the benefits. Depending on your intensity of the interval will mean how long your rest period should be. Usually the more advanced you are, you will perform more difficult, so you'll need longer rest period. This will make you stronger and more powerful. You will also experience EPOC, excessive post-exercise oxygen consumption. You will continue to burn calories after the activity is done. In this program, we will be incorporating a bit of each. HIT is extremely taxing on the body if done correctly and shouldn't be performed very frequently. This is a great way to build up endurance and for your strength training.